What's up guys, this is your boy the Average Gamer 90 over here, back with another video for Injustice 2 Mobile. And in this video, we are gonna look at finishing off boss Harley Quinn, one of the craziest bosses in Heroic 7, tier 1 of Town of Apocalypse Solo Raid. So let's get started with this video here, and we have a double damage reduction of health team here. Deathstroke only has one gear and uh, here we have batman who laughs as well it's gear 70 at four stars and deathstroke is actually having the nora snow globe so that i can do more damage reduction so percentage reduction in health so here you can see the first sp2 there's a percentage reduction in health tagging in batman who laughs and doing an sp1 to do a power drain because of the sword of sin so things to note here for boss harley quinn she is critical attack immune so she's critical attack immune as well as increased power generation and boy oh boy the percentage of power generation increment as the battle progresses is gonna be like very very bad so here we are doing more sp2s from deathstroke 5 million damage here we are doing another sp1 tagging in batman who laughs this is done you know just to maintain the reduction in the power cost so no power from suicide squad harley quinn she can't do any specials and here i am doing more damage with batman who laughs and look at the damage from the boss by the way guys and i'm already in transform form that kind of enables suicide squad harley quinn to gain power to do a special and look i had lost so much health i mean it's it's kind of ridiculous guys it's kind of ridiculous at this point of time that this boss is just it looks to me it's it's just too pumped up amped up it's crazy guys look at the power generation look at the power generation and one gear deathstroke doing some decent amount of damage and this is an advantage with deathstroke as well as batman who laughs they both can stop the opponent from doing a special so yeah i'm, I'm just you know dashing back so that the power generation is decreased and it's no more decreasing health with the swipes so that's why the job for batman who laughs is kind of over so kind of waiting for Suicide Squad Harley Quinn to do a special so that I can do an SP3 and now you know I'm just testing out whether I'm able to still reduce percentage health just tested it out the percentage health doesn't reduce so it's better to let Deathstroke get over get knocked out here we are doing clone and clone SP2 basically <laughs> dashing back because we can't combo interrupt and the boss is doing huge attack with every basics man it's ridiculous so we are able to do a couple of sp2s now dashing back yet dashing back still trying to do one more sp2 and yes we succeeded in doing an sp2 and waiting for it to come close and boom it does a super move finishes this off man. <laughs> guys this boss is ridiculously tough guys it's ridiculously tough and you don't have the boost from artifacts power generation is increased critical attack immune i didn't even want to do an interruption for that special ability man i mean obviously i'm not gonna do any damage like you can see this damage flying off 300 200 it's not 300k it's 300 man so we were able to do only 72 million damage which is we started off with around 132 left so more than 50 percent i'm happy with it that's all the percentage reduction now switching on to the another team here and this is with arkham knight batman and loa so it's it's difficult again because like i mentioned it's with critical attack resist so there are a couple of ways which you can use this team so one is if you're having this team you can use dark metal cards on arkham knight batman and have either the all blades or you know the father box if it's more than level 5 on heartbreaker harley quinn i chose it to be a bit different i don't know whether this is the best strategy i had sword of sin on arkham knight batman and the reason why i had that is because the power generation is significant for a suicide squad harley quinn and that was troubling me quite a lot in the past as well so that's why i kind of stuck with you know having sword of sin here and she's already gained quite a lot of buff and is resisting stuns it's ridiculous it's ridiculous guys look at that fast attack chance twice critical attack damage things are increasing for heartbreaker harley quinn i mean now it's increasing for heartbreaker harley quinn we are able to do some 
critical attacks not all are critical attacks like as you can see there our damage is going to 300k max trying to stun again but no help there tagging in entangling poison ivy to do heal and do some damage entangling poison ivy has a level 8 father box by the way guys it has a level 8 father box but it's not gonna do much damage so let me try and stun and see this is the problem the problem here is if i am stunning i'll have to tag in heartbreaker harley quinn if the crit area is not there because otherwise i'm not gonna crit at all but the crit area doesn't last for a long time as well so it's it's a bummer there so now i could have tagged in entangling poison ivy it could have done a bit more damage i think but i wasn't sure whether this is gonna last so i mean uh, confusions are always there and the battle seems to be pretty straightforward but it isn't doing a lot of damage the problem is that its defense has increased now i'm able to stun finally and i mean i didn't end up finishing off the 60 odd million that was left because i wasn't doing huge amount of damage guys and that is mainly because she's critical attack damage immune so the area needs to be there for me to do any damage like right now there is no area and look at that that's a six star arkham knight batman it's not doing any damage and here we are we are still not getting a lot of crits it's 70 percent chance to do crits but still something it's something because otherwise it's gonna be just complete chaos guys it's just gonna be complete chaos you cannot do any damage at all because it's crit immune so moving forward i think the gameplay is straightforward now you guys have understood so we did 60 which is okay i mean at the end of the day i still think that i said it at the end of the day <laughs> i mean at the end of the day uh it's still okay but uh, i think if i had you know, Arkham Knight Batman with the Dark Metal cards and Heartbreaker Harley Quinn with the level 8 Father Box. I could have possibly ended it. But uh, I think there there is again an ifs and buts because if that was the case, then, you know, Suicide Squad Harley Quinn would end up doing more specials and that would even cause me power drain. So it could have been an issue. So that's why I, you know, stuck with the Sword of Sin instead of, you know, like going with the Dark Metal cards on Arkham Knight Batman. So let's look at the next team here. So we are gonna just finish off Boss Suicide Squad Harley Quinn with this particular team, the Multiverse team, with Multiverse Armor Supergirl as the damage dealer. Got a crit, 786k, only 3.5 million damage to deal. And the reason why Green Arrow is there is uh, he can power drain. So that should be an easy stuff for me. And look at that defense and crit chance increased. Tagging in and look at this, guys. It didn't crit because obviously he's crit immune. Like I'm mentioning several times, it's crit immune, not crit resistance. I was in the crit area. Doing another one, and this time it did crit. So she does a special. And we are almost at full. Now I am just waiting to do an SP SP1 from Green Lantern, and that kind of helps me out. Kind of interesting to see that Green Arrow's SP1 is costing three power bars. Whereas it should actually cost two. Interesting bug again, guys interesting bug i think so it's a bug we'll check that out we'll check that out later so let's move on to the rewards here we finished off heroic one and heroic two of tier seven basically what am i saying tier one and tier two of heroic seven. <laughs> oh man literally my mind is messed up so what are the rewards what is the rewards sad story as always nothing exceptional gary forges are there okay I was super good. Maybe my next seven stars. All right, guys. Thanks for watching this video. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button if you haven't done already. This is your boy, the average gamer 98 over here, signing off. You guys take care. And I'm going to see you in the next one. Peace. Bye bye.